Hello everybody, Rogue Fox here, and welcome back to another Minecraft Bedrock Edition Redstone Tutorial. And in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make a simple and compact redstone counter using the new composter block. Now, let me go ahead and show you how this composter counter works. All we do is simply press this button. We'll get one, two, three, four, five, six, and once we press it again, we get seven. A bell is going to ring, and then the counter is going to reset itself. So we can go ahead and start it all over again. We'll go back up to seven, and then as you saw, this counter is going to reset itself. So let's go ahead and press it a couple more times. And there we go. That is how this works. If you stick around to the end of the video, I will also show you how to make this a horizontal counter. So there we go. It's going to work the exact same way. Before we get started, I do want to explain the redstone behind the composter. So, what we have here is a layout of seven different composters, and the composter takes seven layers before it is completely full, like you see at the bottom. So, with each layer, there are different levels of redstone output. Starting at the top, we do have the empty composter, that is an output of zero. And then as we make our way down, we have an output of one, two, three, four, five, six and then once the composter is full we have an output of eight i also want to mention that the composter requires items to fill it up so we can go ahead and use cake this will guarantee that we will get a layer every single time and different items are going to give a different level of compostability so the pumpkin pie and the cake are for sure 100 percent going to give us a layer and i will post a link to the wikipedia page in the description below so you can check out all the items and the percentages yourself. To make this simple, easy, and compact redstone composter counter, you are going to need a 3x4 area, and also 10 blocks in height. Now let's go ahead and take a look at our supplies. And there we go, there are all the supplies we'll need for today's build. So we have 15 redstone dust, 7 lamps, 4 repeaters, a comparator, 1 dropper, 1 hopper, a stone button, a composter, a bell, now the bell is optional, and if you are building this in or near a village, I don't recommend it because it will cause all of your villagers to run for their homes. And we also have our building blocks, seven glass blocks, a chest, and then a stack of pumpkin pies or cakes. With that being said, if you want to pause the video, go ahead and do that, grab your supplies, and then we'll jump right into the build. To start things off, let's go ahead and place in our collection system and then our composter. So to do that, let's grab our chest, come to the back center here, we want to knock this block out, place in our chest, come over to the left, knock that block out, get your hopper, and crouch place a hopper into the side of the chest. Next, go ahead and grab your composter, and then we want to crouch place the composter on top of the hopper like that. From here, go ahead and grab your blocks, we want to come two temporary blocks up like this, let's knock this block out, get your dropper, and then place your dropper facing down, so it is running into the composter here. We can knock these blocks out. And then let's go ahead and run our comparator out from our composter facing this way. So we should have our setup like this so far. So what this is going to do, let's go ahead and place a block with our button on top. We're going to place in our pumpkin pies. We're going to go ahead and fill this up. So as we press our button, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then that's going to turn into bone meal, and then the bone meal is going to drop down below, and that is going to reset our counter. So that is what this little system does right here. From here, what we can do is place in our redstone lamps. So go ahead and place blocks across the bottom like this. In the center, get your redstone lamps, and then come up seven blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then we can go ahead and fill up the rest of this so the front of the build is all finished so there we go that part is done now all we need to do is place our button right here on the bottom right swing around to the back side line these blocks up on the right with redstone dust place a block against the composter like this and then redstone dust on top of that block so anytime we press this button that's going to activate our dropper pushing the pumpkin pie into the composter and then as you saw this gets to 7, and then it's going to reset itself. So once we have all this done, what we can do is start wiring this up 
to light up all of our lamps. All right, to wire this up, what we're gonna do is run our comparator into a block like this with redstone dust on top. Next, go ahead and grab your glass, place a glass block against the dropper, and to do that, you will need to crouch place it, redstone dust on top of the glass block. Come up two more glass blocks like this with redstone dust on top of those. Two more glass blocks, redstone dust, two more glass blocks, and redstone dust. So from the side, what we have is our comparator running into a block, and then we have a glass tower of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and all of those have redstone dust on top. Once you have this side set up, what we're gonna do next is grab our blocks and swing around to the left side, and right against our first glass block, go ahead and place a block right here, a block up, and then a block right there. We can knock this one out. Go ahead and grab your repeater, run a repeater into this block like this, and then redstone dust on this block right here. So how this works so far, if we give this a push, this is gonna give us our first layer, which is also gonna be an output of one. That's gonna power this block, powering our first redstone lamp, and then we press it again. We get an output of two, which is gonna be right here. That's gonna power that repeater, powering that block, powering this redstone, which powers that block, and then gives us our second redstone lamp. And then we press it once again, we have our output of three right here. That's going to power that. And this is going to repeat itself all the way up to the top. So from here, all we do is repeat what we did right here on all of these back glass blocks. So on the next one up, block out, a block up, a block over, redstone dust, repeater running into that block. We can knock that one out. Again, block out, up, and over, redstone dust repeater knock that out and then we have our last block up here block out up and then leave this blank and then of course we do want to run a repeater into that block so that is all done now let's go ahead and we're going to press it from this side so we can see the redstone work its way up we're going to press it that is going to give us our next output just like that and as you see here everything is making its way up so at the moment, this one is activated. We press it again. That's gonna move over to this side here. And then once we make it up to the top, what we're gonna do is place in our bell because remember, we do get an output of eight. So it is gonna hit seven right here and then eight once it fills up and then it is gonna ding our bell. So like this. And there we go. Now, for those of you who want this to be a horizontal counter, let's go ahead and quickly make this. So, what we need to do for this one is run this comparator into a block once again, except come one more block out like that. So, we should have two blocks, and from here, come over seven more blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then run these blocks like that, going all the way back. Now, go ahead and grab your redstone dust. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And redstone dust right here at the end to make a little L shape. Now for this design, we are gonna have comparators or repeaters for each lamp. So go ahead and swing around here. We wanna place down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like this. And then we do wanna run all these repeaters into blocks. So come a block up like that and bring this all the way down to the first repeater. Now get your redstone lamps, place redstone lamps on the front here. And then get your bell and place your bell on the end. Once you have all of that done, we can go ahead and fill this in. So let's go ahead and build up our front wall like this. Come all the way across. Build this up here. And then fill this across the bottom. So we have ourselves a horizontal display. And then for the button, what we're going to do is place our stone button on the bottom left right here. We want to come three blocks out like this. A block up and then a block against our dropper like that. Then we place two redstone dust here, a repeater running into that block, and then redstone dust on top of this block. And there we go. This thing is all done. So it is going to work the exact same way. So this is going to go up to seven. And then we will get our bell at the end. And then it is going to reset. There's six. And then there's seven. And there we go. And there you have it, everyone. A simple, compact composter counter on Bedrock Edition. This is the end of today's redstone tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Rogue Fox, and I'll see you later.